What up fam? What up family? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Bizmatic and I'm back with another review for y'all. Now it's kind of early so my voice, you know, I'm a little calm. But um, this time around, this time around we got Pearl Jam with Alive. Now this is Alive. Uh, shout out to Tina. She said uh, I would really enjoy this one. Y'all know I love the, the, the crowd action and, and also... Pearl Jam is dope. The most impactful song I think I heard from them is Jeremy. Um, that that was the most impactful. That that that's deep, especially the video. Uh, so I, I don't mind. I don't mind doing any any um Pearl Jam. And if y'all want to see more Pearl Jam on this channel, let me know which one in the comment section below. Now this video is a little long, so let's go ahead and watch. Everywhere that we that we play, and uh, he, he draws it up, and then he gives it to us to kind of check check it out, and we'll. If there's any feedback we can give them, we'll throw something. Or if there's something that we want to play, or if we've run into somebody that you know wants to hear something, we'll throw that out. You know, if it sounds like a good idea. It's, so much of it is just kind of by feel, you know. And I think Ed has is such a great gauge of kind of you know how things are feeling, how the crowd's feeling, and that's a lot of times why the set list doesn't get done until. I mean, sometimes it's done a half an hour before the show, before we play, but a lot oftentimes it's done ten minutes before we play. Ooh. Typically for the encores, it feels like you've kind of given them a pretty good ride at that point, then maybe that first encore would be a sit-down encore or it would be a little bit more of a down encore. Yeah. I was just thinking maybe just, you know, something. Keep it up? They knew, yeah, or either that or, you know, a lot. Last X or a small town, <coughs> just something else that they know that they can sing along to. It's just not okay. a, a journey for them. They, yeah. Okay. Yeah. We could do uh, Small Town Once Alive, Rock and Led Better. Goddamn Romans. You know how to build a drum room.
Wow, that was dope. That was dope. Uh, well, I mean, they could play. They could. They, they could definitely, definitely play. Very engaging. Again, like the crowd action. Like they're singing these songs so loud, it's almost louder than the instrumentation itself. Now, through some headphones, that's great. But me, I always trying to put myself in the building. Like, imagine in the building how that building is probably shaking. Imagine how much energy and, and how much they're fueling um, that artist or those artists. And another thing, incredible, 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 incredible instrumentation. Especially that guitar solo at the end, amazing. Dope, dope drums and, a, and another thing. I love how he just ran across and just fell and and just like he was just in the moment, in the moment. I don't know how I would feel if I if I um. But that's the thing about rock and roll though. <clears throat> Nothing's choreographed, so you could you could fall. It don't it don't matter. And, and this song 
it is one of those songs I feel like it got to people's souls like you know these this is the type of song that you heard it at a certain moment and then it just stuck with you cuz you know the way that they're singing it's like yo they they singing it from deep deep within another thing I like about this video I like how it shows like um a little bit backstage in their process of all right what are we gonna give these people for an encore right that's that that's dope people don't understand how much time it oh hold up my bad i'm gonna shut this thing off on y'all people don't understand how much um time it, it, it takes to put these shows together but they you know how incredible it is they said well some nights some nights it it, it, it well it depends on, on how the show was some nights um, they could put the set together, uh, but uh, that was kind of confusing actually because it said some nights they could put the show together in 10 minutes or some nights it's 30 minutes. How do they, I understand how they do the encore, but how do they predict that? But I remember, it just reminds me when, when, when I used to do shows and stuff and we used to get to the, to the thing and then. I'm usually prepared, but like when you when you backstage and stuff, and then you see a lot of people, how some people are just putting their set together like right on the spot, and then sometimes you gotta like switch a song. You gotta be like, nah, I don't, I don't wanna do that song. I'm gonna do this song. Um, it, it, it's just dope, man. I, I love seeing stuff like that. Another dope performance by Pearl Jam. Y'all let me know if y'all wanna see more Pearl Jam on this channel, and also let me know how you felt about it in the comment section below, all right? And um, yeah, if you made it this far, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell. Join the squad, we'll be glad to have you. Uh, and I'll see y'all in the next one, and guess what, you better be there. Oh, like the video, share it with somebody, peace.